A lot of travelers will be driving Route 66 soon. That's because every summer, of course, it brings tourists through Tulsa on their way either east or west. And News on 6's Emory Bryan has an update on the effort to get those travelers to stop here and spend some money. Well, some people believe that Tulsa is just beginning to cash in on Route 66, and now there's some new momentum to make sure that happens. Tulsa is slowly warming up to the idea that Route 66 can be a year-round tourist attraction. What's unique about Tulsa's Route 66 and drive that message? Because Route 66 obviously goes clear to California, but each one of us has a unique experience. With Cyrus Avery and all the other neon we have, we have to focus on those assets and then basically market that to those visitors. The city is just beginning a project to restore elements of the old highway, like the neon on this sign for Billy Ray's Barbecue. This old gas station was empty for years and now it's been remodeled and soon that old building will have new neon too. We need to hang on to those and we need to really resurrect them and, and get them up and running again and any cool neon signs we have left we can get those lit again with the neon sign grant. Businesses are realizing that Route 66 branding is a way to draw in customers and it works whether that's for a Goodwill thrift store or a small diner that caters to travelers. Tulsa's Route 66 Commission is meeting to develop a more comprehensive marketing strategy, but some of it is as easy to understand as restoring those places along the highway that used to bring in travelers. Anything that's, you know, roadside transportation related, all of those gas stations and automotive repair shops are finding new lives as everything from an architect's office to an entertainment venue. And the Chamber of Commerce notes that as the city is replacing and improving infrastructure, that's encouraging business to, uh, businesses to make investments. And all of that is encouraging tourists to stop in and drop some money in Tulsa. Of course, that stays here. Reporting live near 11th and Peoria, Emory Bryan, Oklahoma's own News on 6.